hello everyone and welcome back to our channel in today's video i'll be showing you how you can add a payments gateway in godaddy websites in 2024 whether you are running an e-commerce store or offering some online services integrating a payments gateway is very crucial for accepting some payments online so make sure to follow this guide to add a payments gateway to your godaddy website in 2024 and let's get started before we start with this video, make sure to watch it from now till the end so you have full experience. First, you'll need to go and open a browser. Here I'm using Brave Browser for you. Of course, you can use whatever you want. Go to the URL section once you open it. Type godaddy.com, hit the enter button, and this should take you to the home screen or main screen of GoDaddy right away. If it's your first time, you'll find the sign in option here. Click on it. And you'll be able to sign in into an account if you have one. If you don't, you'll be able to go and create a new one. You'll be able to use it to, uh, to create an account using, I guess, Google, Facebook, and Microsoft. If you don't want to get through all the bonus steps of filling up your information alone. And of course, you can do it manual way using email. And of course, once you do so, you'll find yourself here with your name or your username at the top right corner. So once you're logged in into your account, as we said, we would like to add a payment gateway. So to add a payments gateway, first of all, I'll just go here to websites and click on website builder and click on start for free. As you can see, no credit card required. I'll just go and create a new site and I'll make it a store. So sales, goods and services, continue. And uh, how do you want to sell my website example? How much do you want? Uh, I just, I'm just getting started. Uh, what's our going? I'll just do bakery. Why not? Uh, name. I'll just do Omics store as simple as that then click on continue and here of course you'll be able to fill your uh, to fill up your phone number and your email address then click on continue of course your contact information is if people want to contact you building your website as you can see so the AI will basically build kind of everything for me so AI is, once it's invented it helps you like doing a lot of things so as you can see in here You'll find yourself here. You'll find about the menus if you want to add any menus. So for me, I'll just add maybe menus. Uh, maybe as an example, I'll just add about uh, photo gallery. Why not? Menu and price. Why not? Contact us. Why not? And social uh, links. Why not? And as you can see here, you can add a PayPal button if you want to buy something. Subscribe introduction button uh to find out more i'll just add even this section so there's some sections if you want to add of course if you didn't add something in your regrets and you want to add this you'll be able to add this after so i'll just go here and click on continue to my site and yeah as you can see that's a new site so here now i don't want to take a tour all i need to do here i'll just go and click on preview as an example and see how is this site is doing so as an example if someone wants to buy something maybe a city walking tour Per default, this site is totally created by its own. I did not do nothing on it. So let's see the payments gateway that are included in GoDaddy per default. So I'll just go and click on buy now. As you can see, it seems like here, uh, MasterCard, Visa, Discover, American Express, and PayPal. So I'll just go here and click on buy now and see where we'll, as you can see, where does that take me? To my PayPal account right away. So it seems like PayPal is the payments gateway that's added per default, okay? What about uh, if I go here as example, let me just go here to store or to shop. Yeah, I don't know why this is not working. Of course, I did not customize uh, anything on this like website. So don't mind it. So may it seems like not working as intended. I'll just go here and click on uh, uh, edits. And of course, I'll just go and click on add products so I can add something. So here, as you can see, you're almost ready. I'll just wait for the products to be added. So I'll find myself on this page. Of course, for me, I'll just do a, like a physical, add an image, I'll just add a random image that I have. Uh, why not I'll add just this croissant or whatever it's called in English. Product name, I'll just name it this, uh, price 10. Uh, other than that, like I'll not, I'll not fill up those informations like shipping. I don't know if a, I can save it like that way or I'll still have, to, okay, it's saved. So as you can see, I have now products on my store. So I'll just go and publish that as an example. 
let's just wait for the, uh, the store until it's published to check everything like how it's working if someone is really going to buy what payments gives away that he's going to find so i'll just click on view sites which will take me to a new tab to the specific websites right away so i'll just go to shop as an example i want to buy something and i'll click on this okay like it add to cart of course as you can see let me just go back before clicking on add to cart it seems like google pay is already added as you can see so google pay is already added and let me just go and click on add to a guard as you can see you can pay with google pay and if i click on checkout of course to why not let me just wait for the page to load of course it's a, it's a free website on a random uh, like domain name so don't mind it if it's like that so as you can see you'll have to fill up your customer information uh, or you can pay with google pay so I'll just fill up here some random informations like test at uh, gmail.com as an example, optional. So I'll just fill up some random things in here. Click on continue. So just, I want to see the, sh the, the shipping and payments. So yeah, as you can see on the payments, it seems like you can pay with your credit card. Okay. You can pay with Google Pay and you can uh, slash debit card and you can pay with Pay's wallet. No PayPal in here. So I guess this should be uh, like should has Visa, Mastercard, and etc. So okay, it's good. That seems it seems like good. Let me just go and check one last thing. I'll just go back to the online store, go to the homepage. Uh, I want to go to the homepage. So if I scroll down in here, uh, yeah, as I find here, so I'll just go and click on that. As you can see, I can even pay with PayPal on that option. So PayPal is already added. So what gateway should we add more here? So I'll just go and not now. So here I'll just go to this uh, right option, websites and store. I'll just right click on that and click on manage store. Here I'll find myself here. So I'll scroll down until I find this manage uh, settings and I'll go to payments and click on payments, go to payments. Once I find myself here, payments methods. So as you can see, it gets paid quickly, securely. So as you can see here, it's connected already per default as you can see all the features that comes with it so pay the industry lowest fees as you can see future proofs business easily and etc accepts all major credits and debit cards uh, apple pay etc so already is already added per default but you'll be able to go and click on manage payment to manage your own payment to add whatever you want to remove whatever you want and here's an example you'll be able to do that and as you can see, you all set up to take payments to get your funds deposited into your bank you'll have to go and complete the verification and etc uh so i don't think that the page this wants so yeah here yeah okay so here if you scroll down as you can see so other uh credit card and things that are not added in this uh payments here on my website i can add it like a uh, paypal commerce platform i'll be able to connect it as you can see only uh you can use one credit card processor at once examples you can add uh, square you can add stripe you can access paypal and connect it you can accept online payments and enable it so you can add whatever payments get away here on your website and it will be added to your website right away on the checkout experience so that's going to be it for me today thank you for watching and goodbye